Hey guys, hey, I want to bring you a quick little video today on a uh, leather holster from Pure Custom. As you guys know, I'm a big fan of Pure Custom. <clears throat> and uh, I have one of his uh, appendix holsters. I have several of his holsters, uh, but I have his uh, appendix holster that I wanted to show you. Uh, not a lot of people realize that you uh, can have a uh, leather appendix holster, um, but when it's as strong as Kydex, he calls it Cowdex, uh, you can have a really nice appendix holster that hides and conceals very, very well. That is unloaded, by the way. Let me show it to you real quick. This is the super thin, now I did put a wedge on the back, uh, like most appendix holsters, with the extreme, is that what he's called, the extreme holster. Um, and it's obviously got a cutout for the um, red dot. This is a unloaded, pistol and I'll tell you it fits beautifully in the waist and again if you guys don't understand what Caldex is I didn't either until he told me uh, basically it is a all 100% leather with exception of the uh, the clips, which are plastic, um, or Kydex as well. I'm not really sure which ones those are. He can correct us on that. But uh, it is 100% leather that he has a special formula that he uses to make this extremely hard. Um, but it is extremely comfortable um, when you wear it because it's really wide and it distributes that weight really well, where a lot of these, as you can see, are th much thinner, but they're also much thicker. So you can see kind of the the thinness, um, and what I like about this is if you can see, he has an, he has the indentation here, so it's a perfect spot to put your wedge. Now you could have a, uh, a bigger one, you could have a small one, you could have a much thinner one if you wanted. <clears throat> but um, what's interesting about this is that when you wear them, they are very uh, thin, and it's wider, like I said, so it really tucks in, and it really pulls into your your side and to your uh, stomach area so it conceals this very nicely so anyway uh it will also fit the staccato cs it will also fit uh he now he makes them for staccato cs he makes them for nick or atlas he makes them for st all staccatos um this happens to be a nighthawk but it fits in beautifully and covers if you guys can see that red dot and how he does that it's pretty masterful Anyway, just want to give you a little uh, update on this. Uh, like I said, I'm a big fan of his holsters. These things are hard. This is extremely comfortable. Um, and uh, it's, I mean, it's amazing. So if you like leather and you want something a little different than a big chunky appendix holster like this, which is still a good holster because it's got the wedge or it's got the, uh, the claw, but when you have a wider one like this, it just distributes that weight really evenly. Uh, and if you hold, if you put it this way or this way, depending, some of you guys run them like this. Some people like me, I run them a little to the side. This is a little flexible, so it pulls that, that belt pulls that gun in. And of course that wedge kicks it back a little bit. This is a very nice holster. So anyway, thanks guys. Hope you guys like it.